What's up guys, Luis Pacheco here, and I'm back with another video. It's a little different video than what you've normally seen on this channel, but I am in my newly redone recording studio. Um, two weeks ago, I got this crazy idea. This was uh, the studio I was using, the space, it was big open space, and um, I've always wanted to redo this place, and so I hit up a friend and I was like, hey, um, I wanna remodel the studio. Um, what do you think? Yeah, let's do it. We can start tomorrow, go get the material. I said, okay, cool. So we built this wall, um, set the glass, the door. We painted the entire room, bought some new gear. Um, and so here we are uh, two weeks later. It took us about a week to, to, to do it all, um, but it's done and I'm excited about using this new space. Hopefully you get to see some more videos uh, in this room. I plan to record more videos in here and uh, also record the process of recording or the things that I'm doing um, in the studio if I have sessions or things like that. But today, we're not here for to talk about that. We're here to talk about a new partnership that I just um, that I just started with Zounds, Z Zounds Z um, which is super crazy. Uh, I have been a a, a customer of Z Zounds for years. If you're like me. Um, growing up, I wasn't rich. I didn't have a lot of money. And so being able to get some of the instruments I wanted or needed, they offered payment plans, which was like huge for me when I found that out. And so I bought tons of gear there. A lot of the bases and, and gear that you've seen me with on this channel was purchased through there, including the video of In Jesus Name that, that you know, did really well. It's got like 2 million views on my channel. That base, that green seafoam base, uh, was actually purchased on Z Zounds. And so um, they reached out to me and um, you know, we're, we're gonna be working together and I'm super pumped about that. So yes, this video is sponsored by Z Zounds. If you're looking to purchase any kind of gear, any kind of gear that you're looking for, audio, guitars, basses, keyboard, recording gear, you name it, whatever it is, go check out their website, zounds.com. They also have the payment plans that I was talking about, very affordable payments. Um, a lot of the, the payments, uh, payment uh, plans that they offer, no credit check needed. Um, so it's a super cool website to purchase all the gear that you're looking for. And man, customer service, everything that they do is just top notch. So I'm super excited to be working with them. So they sent me out a bunch of gear for this recording studio um, that I'm really excited to unbox and set up. Uh, let me walk you through some of the stuff I got. So right here, right next to me, I have the Bluey compressor slash limiter. This is by Black Lion, Black Lion Audio. I got two of these compressors. I got two, actually I got three of the Sennheiser MD421s. The, I'm gonna use these for like tom mics, horns, guitar caps, things like that. I got the Beta, the Sure Beta 91A for the inside of the kick. Behind here, I have this Warm Audio. This is the 251 tube condenser microphone for vocals, um, things of that nature. And so, um, and so yeah, so they sent me this. This is a great mic. And then they sent me the AKG. These are the C414s. They sent me the, the, the stereo pack, the duals, two mics, of, uh, two of the mics. So I'll probably be using these, not probably, I will be using these for like overheads. Um, these are great vocal mics as well. And then um, the other compressors over here. But then I also got a Heritage Audio. This is the HA73X2 Elite. This is a, a Neve clone and it's two of them. So it's two pre's in one rack. So excited to be able to use this. Um, these products, uh, I think it's gonna be um, a lot of fun getting to play with this gear. I've actually, in all the studios that I've had and setups that I've had, I've never had any outboard gear. Um, and I was talking to my buddies, uh, Hector, we call him Sport, and my friend Jaime, and um, I told them I wanted to get into it. They recommended pretty much all, everything that you see here was because they recommended it. And uh, so shout out to them, thank you guys for uh, helping me choose some of this gear, but I'm super pumped. I'm gonna start unboxing some of this stuff and just getting it set up and um, yeah, let's get going. So 
here's the Heritage Audio, the Neve clones that I was talking about. Um, this is a two channel pre um, that I'm really excited about using. I've heard great stuff about Heritage Audio and their products. So to be able to have this, use this for like vocals and um, other kinds of stuff is gonna be super cool. So pumped about this, this is the two channel X, the X73 or H73 X2. Um, highly recommend it, check it out. Um, I've heard great reviews, I've seen videos on it, heard the quality that comes out of it. So um, yeah, just pumped to have this in the studio. All right, now we're unboxing the Black Lion Audio, the Bluey compressor. I got two of these so that I would have, you know, if I was doing anything, any kind of stereo, if I was doing like stereo mics on something, I wanted to have, be able to have the ability to do the, um, to have compressors for both, both channels. Sheesh. Man, this thing is nice. This is crazy. So this is a compressor slash limiter. This is like your 11, 1176 um, like clone, uh, the original 1176. That's what they're trying to model this after. And so um, these are this is a one channel uh, compressor. Like I said, that's why I got two. So pumped to get to use these. Here's the second one. Same thing, same compressor. I'm actually really excited about these mics. These mics are incredible. So getting to have a pair in the studio is gonna be such a game changer uh, for what I do. And um, yeah, it's gonna be fun getting to use these. Um, like I said, I I'm curious. I've, I've seen videos uh, with them on, on vocals. I've mainly heard them like on drum overheads and they sound phenomenal. So um, excited to just get to try these out on vocals and all kinds of other stuff. Love this case that it comes in. The paperwork. Oh man. So this is what it looks like once you, when you get it in the box. Man, these mics are Beautiful. The C414, they come in with these nice AKG bags, uh, pouches to store them in. They come with the shock mounts. They come with the, um, the mount for you to be able to do like the XY pattern with these mics, obviously with the clips. And then they also come with these, um, like pop filters, they go on, they just sit on them like this. This comes with two of these as well. So these mics are fire. I'm actually really excited to use these. Pumped that, um, that I was able to get these, so. Next, we got the Sennheiser MD421s. Um, and I've used these uh, for years in various studios, live performances, pretty much in any um, setting that I've been able to be in, whether it be live or studio. Um, I've used these mics, I've used them on horns, drums, guitar cabs, um, and they sound amazing. So pretty basic, um, it was just in this box and then they come in this case. Um, these mics are incredible. You cannot go wrong with an MD421. Um, and so I got three of these, I've got these other two here. So um, we're gonna be using these for toms and mainly for toms here in the studio. So. And then last but not least, I got the WA, the Warm Audio 251 tube condenser mic. Um, this mic comes recommended from, like I said, my friend Jaime and Sport. So um, excited to get to use this on vocals for 
projects and clients and all. So it says this is gear of the year 2019, highly recommended. We about to find out. So as soon as I open the box, I got paperwork with some warm audio stickers. You know, you gotta have the stickers. Oh man, this is awesome packaging. So the mic comes in this beautiful warm audio case. Let's open that up. Wow. Oh, this is beautiful. And there you have the mic. It's got good weight to it. Wow, this is a beautiful mic. So excited to get to use this, hear it, how it sounds uh, with vocals. I got a few projects work that I'm working on. And um, so getting to have this is gonna be a lot of fun. Uh, it comes with your shock mount, pretty standard there. Uh, it comes with some extra rubber bands for the shock mount. Then it comes with the power supply. Uh, it comes with the power cable. And then these mics require a special cable. This is a this is a seven pin cable for this um, tube mic. So, yep, that's all that's in this box. Pretty uh, pretty basic. So yeah, that's all the gear I got so far. Um, we may or may not have some more gear. We may be getting some more. Who knows? But excited to get to work with. Z sounds and um, just produce some great quality content. Let's get all this gear set up. Let's put it in the rack uh, on the desk and um, yeah, it's fired up. Just finished setting up the two compressors and the uh, Heritage Audio HA73. <sighs> These things are beast. Um, I haven't plugged them in, but just like looking at them, they're just, they're built well. The knobs feel great. Um, it's, a, it's a good build quality. Same thing with the Heritage Audio. Um, got them wired up. On each side of my desk, I have these radial um, power conditioners. And then I put the compressors up top um, and then the, the uh, preamp down and towards the bottom. And then I left these slots open to add more preamps. I have 
two Apollo 8s. I have an AP and 8 and then a twin. So I have a total of 18 inputs. Um, I have a total of 14 pre's, uh, universal audio pre's. And then I have four inputs for um, just for my, for like these kind of preamps, uh, outboard, outboard uh, gear, things like that. That's what I'll be using those inputs for. Uh, once I get more preamps, then, you know, you can bypass the actual universal audio preamp um, and just connect whatever other preamp I have. So for the meantime, I'm gonna have some spacers here um, just to kind of close up the desk. You won't see these massive gaps, but uh, I'm excited to uh, power these up and see how they do. Just turning them on for the first time. It's crazy. Pumped. Excited to get to use this. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching it, for taking your time to watch um, me do what I do. Um, gonna do what I do without you guys. These partnerships, the things that I get to do, the companies I get to work with, it's all because of you, because of your support, because you watch these videos, because you wanna see the content. And um, so without you guys, without the faithful subscribers, and for all the new subscribers that are coming in, without you guys, I couldn't do what I do. So thank y'all. Thank you so much. Z Zounds, again, thank you so much for sponsoring this video. Thank you for sending all this gear out. Um, we'll be doing some more videos, uh, showing you more behind the scenes on the studio, the gear that we're using, and, um, and other videos that, that will be coming um, in the future. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, share it. Share with somebody that you think that might enjoy this kind of content. Also, if you want to stay up to date with everything that's going on, hit that bell button uh, so that you get a notification every time I post a video. Sometimes the algorithm hides the videos, things like that. But if you want to stay connected with everything that I'm doing on this channel, hit that bell button and uh, you'll stay up to date to ev with everything that's happening. So I'm signing off again. Thank you all so much. And we'll see you on the next one. Peace.